Wow, you guys, I'm like, what? How is this even a dollar? Like, one day they're just going to take over all the high-end. High-end products are going to be non-existent. <laughs> Hey everyone, so welcome back to another video. So for today, I'm going to be trying out 99 cent store makeup. I love going to the 99 cent store, but I really don't go often because I live pretty far. So yeah, if you're new, welcome. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I try to upload every week, like once or twice a week. I try to be as consistent as possible, but when I'm not, just be patient with me sometimes so life happens and yeah so let's just go ahead and get so started. I was at the 99 cent store a few days ago and I came across this new makeup that I was like what I had never seen it before so I was so excited so I only picked up three items I was trying to pick out something like for a full face they had a cream to powder foundation but they didn't have my shade unfortunately that's what happens with the 99 cent store they only had dark chocolate shades so yeah that that won't match me so i picked up three items for three dollars <laughs> i literally spent three dollars so i picked up picked up a single eyeshadow a liquid lipstick and a highlight so the first product I have that I'm going to try out on my eyes is a single eyeshadow in the shade Morocco by the brand Smoky Mirrors. I think I've heard of this brand before. I'm not too sure. Let me know down in the comments if you've ever heard of this brand. It sounds very familiar, but I just can't pinpoint. So this is the way it looks. On the back, it claims that it has a very strong color payoff and it glides on perfectly for a gorgeous look. So I'll be trying that on my eyes. And then I have the... Remy Rose Everlasting Liquid Lipstick. I really like this shade. It was like a perfect nude and I always go for nudes. I think that looks perfect with my skin tone. So this claims to be an everlasting matte liquid lipstick and very long lasting, smudge proof and a formula for all day dramatic lips. So the next thing I have is this highlighter that really caught my attention. It reminds me of the new e.l.f. highlighter that's been out for a while but i haven't been able to get my hands on it it's always sold out at my local walmart so it's by the brand smoke and mirrors and it looks like this and it just claims to be um, luminous baked formula applies smoothly with light texture applies easy for a natural finish brush it onto cheekbones brow bones and all over the face and all over the body for a radiant glow so i'm most excited to try out the highlight so yeah let's just get started so I'm gonna get started with the eyeshadow and I'm just gonna apply that I'm literally just gonna use this eyeshadow and it looks like this it looks like a really pretty color they only had this and like a purple but I don't really like purple so this one caught my attention more so I'm literally just going to apply that all over the lids for like a basic smoky eye maybe just um, blend it out a little bit with the highlight we'll see okay so for eye base i always go in with my nyx eyeshadow base in the shade nude this one always makes all my eyeshadows just pop okay so let me do a little swatch of this shade it feels really buttery oh wow i'm impressed you guys for one dollar a single eyeshadow i was expecting it to be like less pigmented that looks really pretty so i'm very excited i always get excited with i always get excited with very affordable makeup that's typically what i do here on my channel if you're new so i'm just going to get a brush and just tap that on all over the lid Ooh, I love how pigmented that looks. Wow, for being 99 cents, I'm like shook right now. And it hardly has any fallout. Wow, I'm impressed. So 
So let me do a quick swatch of this as well. Wow, this one also feels very... Wow, you guys. I am shook. Like, what? How is this even a dollar? Wow. Oh, my God. You all saw it. Life swatches for you all. Wow, this looks really nice. Wow, I'm shook. So I'm going to take a fluffy brush just to kind of like blend it out at the edges and i'm also going to use it as inner corner highlight as well i'm just taking a little oh i like how smooth no. and buttery no. the single eyeshadow feels it's just really easy to blend it doesn't look patchy at all i really think the the I really think the NYX eyeshadow base really helps it blend and for the color to pop. So next I'm going to be going in with the highlight. I'm just taking it all on my cheeks. I hope it's not too light for my skin type. So I'm just taking a Morphe brush and I'm just going to dust that. Like so. I'm just going to dust it. Okay, so you do need to build it up. Wow, I'm like, yeah. what? A 99 cent oh. store. Oh. If only all their makeup could be like this, I would be like, yes, please. <laughs> I feel like it kind of has like a, like a pinkish, purplish undertone to it. Which I'm not mad about because it is different than what I have already in my makeup collection. Looks a little bit frosty. Wow, you guys, I'm like, what? How is this even a dollar? Like, one day they're just going to take over all the high-end. High-end products are going to be non-existent. <laughs> I almost forgot inner corner highlight. Wow. Like what? The last and final product I have here is the Remy Rose liquid lipstick in the shade Kendall. So I feel like this was going to match really well with the eye look. So let's do a little live swatch. I'm like so excited with these swatches. Wow, that looks pretty. It's like a nice nude. It's kind of like a um, orange terracotta kind of color. It looks beautiful. So let's just apply that. I'm really loving the lip color. I feel like it looks like my lips but better it really matches the eye look and I'm gonna go ahead and apply some it feels sticky it feels really sticky mm, I don't think I like the lip color it feels like super sticky I feel like I feel like I have glue on my lips so the color is beautiful but yeah no I'm gonna go ahead and apply some eyeshadow on my bottom lower lash line Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and apply some lashes, finish up the rest of my makeup, and I will be right back to give you all my final thoughts. Okay, so I am back. So overall, I am super impressed with this 99 cent store makeup. My favorite was the highlight because it's so intense and it has kind of like a purplish, pinkish undertone, which I don't have in my collection. I absolutely loved it. I mean, 99 cents. What? If you ever if you ever see this pick it up if you're into highlight like I am the single eyeshadow wow I am like whoa I loved the way it blended it blended out really seamlessly like no problems whatsoever you all saw my swatches like what I don't know how they do it a dollar and the 
liquid lipstick it did dry down completely already but when i had it at first when i had first applied it it was super sticky like it felt like i had glue i really thought it was gonna stay that way but it didn't so i really did end up liking it i like the color it looks really pretty and it matches with the eye look so yeah overall guys i'm so impressed i literally spend three dollars on all these items and i am impressed wow i really hope the 99 cents store keeps making products like this or keeps you know selling products like this i don't think they make it but i really hope they keep coming out with these products like I'm shook like I'm speechless I don't even know what else to say but pick pick these up if you ever see them they are really good they, they also had lip liners and they had another shade of this single eyeshadow but I didn't like it and they had another shade of the highlight it was a little bit darker for my skin tone so they did have several options there I hope you all enjoyed my 99 cent store makeup try on let me know what was your favorite down below and I'll see you all in another video. Bye!